Now, the anger between the two sides in Washington, very evident. Wisconsin's own representatives are not immune. Here's Milwaukee Congresswoman Gwen Moore on the floor of the House this morning. This whole debate is a subterfuge and a proxy for our strong desire to bring this nation to its knees and to punish the people for electing Barack Obama president of the United States. Democrat Ron Kind, who represents La Crosse, released a statement today. It reads in part, this is a self-inflicted wound, a manufactured crisis brought upon our country by an irresponsible House majority that is willing to shut down the federal government in order to achieve its ideological goals. Now, he also reached out to several area Republicans today. In release from uh, Congressman Tom Petrie from Sheboygan, he explains that he did vote to prevent the shutdown and that the ball is now in the Democrats' court. Uh, the statement uh, reads, I do not want a shutdown, and I don't believe it's in anyone's best interest. I'd like to see the Senate act on the House passed bill so we can move past this and do the work of the American people that we were sent here to do. Now, Wisconsin's own representatives also getting into this war of words. We spoke with Milwaukee Congresswoman Gwen Moore. She's in Washington, D.C., and she has nothing good to say about a few members of the Republican Party. They're on their own. They are not working with the team. There are 40 to 60 people in the, in the, on the Republican Party that do not have a sense of uh, what's good for the National Party, or, nor what's good for the American people. We also contacted several area Republicans today. Congressman Tom Petrie from Sheboygan sent us an email. It says, in part, I do not want a shutdown. I don't believe it's in anyone's best interest. I'd like to see the Senate act on the House passed bill so we can move past this and do the work of the American people that we were sent here to do.